So welcome to this uh, brief introduction about the module on NumPy and Matplotlib. So I'll just walk you through the way we have structured the content in this particular module. So there are going to be five notebooks. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll start with vectors. Okay. The idea of vectors and how we can represent them using NumPy arrays. Right. So that's where we'll start. It'll be a very gentle introduction to NumPy arrays. And then what we'll do is we'll shift gears and we'll move to matplotlib, the plotting utility in Python. And we look at simple line plots, right? How do we plot, say, straight lines? How do we plot parabolas, things like that, right? And maybe some small, simple functions like trigonometric functions and so on. Okay, so that is the second notebook. Then we'll move to slightly more complex NumPy arrays, which are matrices, right? So matrices are also NumPy arrays. They can also be represented as NumPy arrays. And we'll see how that can be done. We we'll look at some some of the common operations that we do on matrices, and see how that can be translated to NumPy. Okay, so that's what the third notebook will concern itself with. The fourth notebook, what we'll do is we'll once again go back to matplotlib. We'll see how we can do different kinds of plots: bar plots, scatter plots, histograms, to name the three most important plots we'll be looking at, and we'll we'll present them from the point of view of statistics, right? So probability and statistics, where we, we are going to sample from some distributions like Bernoulli, let's say Gaussian, or say a Gaussian mixture model, right? Or multivariate Gaussian distribution, right? So when you sample from these distributions, you, distributions, you get a collection of points. And what we can do is we can visualize these points or the sample in terms of plots, right? So we could do bar plots for Bernoulli samples from a Bernoulli distribution. And we could do a histogram for samples from a Gaussian distribution, so on, right? So that's what we'll do in the fourth notebook. The final notebook is the fifth notebook. And that's probably the most important notebook where we'll be discussing NumPy arrays in general, okay? So we'll be looking at some of the important methods associated with NumPy arrays, such as reshape, or maybe finding the maximum, minimum along a particular axis, okay? Sorting, arc sort, okay? So these are all some of the important functions that will be or methods that we'll be looking at in the final notebook. We'll also briefly discuss certain ideas such as view and copy. How, how do you, what happens when you reshape a NumPy array? Do you create a new NumPy array or are you only, are you copying the data? So on and so forth, right? So these are all some miscellaneous discussions that will happen in the final notebook. Okay. Yeah. So hope you enjoy the series. Thanks.